Hi, I'm Nick Bennett and I'm the Staff Scientist with the Natural Resources Council of Maine. And here we are today at the banks of the Penobscot uh, on the edge of the constructed road that the equipment will use um, over the next number of weeks to take out the whole Great Works Dam, which you can see behind me. And this is the first step of a uh, two dam removal, multi fishway construction uh, project to um, free up a thousand miles of rivers and streams to sea run fish where they haven't been able to go for over a century and it's a really exciting day for the Penobscot River, for salmon, for shad, for alewives, for ospreys, for eagles and for me. People have been through a lot of trying times together. Industrial development and unbalanced practices once had this river extremely sick. It seemed our complaints and efforts to get it back on its feet fell on deaf ears. Today, though, it is obvious that people are listening in a very diverse way and understand the importance of not simply taking from this great resource, but also giving back. Brownie Carson, formerly Executive Director of the Natural Resources Council of Maine. It's an absolutely fabulous day to be on the banks of the Penobscot River because a dozen years or more of work by NRCM and our partners in the Penobscot River Restoration Trust is beginning to come to fruition with the removal uh, over the next couple of months of the Great Works Dam. I uh, just, you know, it's, it's one thing to talk about it and work on it and negotiate it and do all the things, raise money for it, uh, do all the things that many of us have done over the years. It's another thing altogether to actually be standing here and watching the steam shovels get ready to take this dam down. This event also is about the economics that come with the restoration of the river. I know many of you know what the value is of the fisheries and the recreation that takes place in the Penobscot River. But you look across the United States of America and there are some nine million jobs that come with outdoor recreation across this country. So as we look at the future of the United States of America and budgeting decisions that the members of the congressional delegation and others will be making, let's make sure that we're putting our feet on the ground and saying that conservation and jobs and investment in conservation are real important because it's going to make things like this happen across the United States of America. Trust. So I've been with this project since the beginning and it's really exciting to see the dam come out. 